Hello, hello. How's it going? Welcome to Life is Strange True Colors. So, this is the third Life is Strange game. I figured it's about time I play this, because there is a new Life is Strange game coming out. I've already blanked on the, on the name, but you play as Max again. Max Caulfield from the first game. Um, and she's older now, which is interesting. That's all I've seen about it, honestly. Um, there was music playing. <laughs> if you're wondering why it's so goddamn quiet, there was music playing. I had to turn it off <laughs> because I went into the settings and it was like, oh, mute licensed music, obviously, because I don't want copyright strike. And that shit went dead silent. <laughs> so, yeah. I mean, that's not new because that's kind of how it was in the second game. You mute the licensed music and then there's a... Uh, Dead quiet. Um, so we're gonna start a new game. I don't know what by Steph's story is. I don't know if it's gonna be like the second game where it was like, oh, to fully enjoy this experience in this chapter, play this short little whatever. Um, but it was free, but this is not free. I don't know. I don't know who Steph is. So maybe we can play that after or like during if it if it like I'm assuming if it's anything like the second game, it'll be like, hey, if you want to fully enjoy this chapter, play this first. Um, but anyway, new game. Yes, I am aware. For Alex, okay. So, Alex is the name of the character. Oh, is that me? So, Alex. That is me. The day's finally here. You've been at the Helping Hands group home for eight years. We've been through a lot in that time. We have. And now you're finally leaving to live with your brother. My brother Gabe. Aww. It says here he lives in Haven Springs, Colorado. Hey, Colorado! Let's go! <laughs> I don't know where Haven Springs is, but... <laughs> Do you have any plans as far as school or a job? For those of you who don't know, I live My in Colorado. Said I might pick up a few shifts at the bar he works at. I used to live in Vegas, but now I live in Colorado. So you'd be dealing with people. That doesn't sound great. Maybe. <laughs> She's like, she knows my issue is people. Does your brother be. know about your issues? What type of issues? Is that an official interview question, Dr. Lynn? She's like, oh, wait a minute. You're getting a little too clingy there. You know that I care about you. With everything that has happened. What happened? I just want what's best I for you. I we'll learn, obviously, throughout the game. He doesn't know. No one will once I leave this place. I'll just be a normal girl in a normal town. So I'm assuming this is going to cut back to, like, before this therapist meeting, this is what happened. I think. Okay, Life is Strange True Colors, here we go. Yeah, this is obviously, I'm, I'm assuming it's called True Colors, because it's like, oh, she's showing her true colors, or whatever. whatever. Apparently, I don't, I, from what I've seen, she, I mean, literally in the thumbnail, she's like, mm, you know, the, the game, whatever. Chapter 1, side A, oh. But from, like, the pictures, she's like, holding her hand, like, oh, she has powers. I don't know what kind of powers, is it like, is it gonna be like, frickin' Daniel's powers in the second game where you can move stuff with your whatever or okay well we shall see I like her design it's cute Gabe said to meet him at the bridge I can't wait to see him okay so this is still after the or is this before I don't know okay uh all I can do is just walk oh I can walk like a tiny bit faster. Okay, so I'm assuming that's my jog button, but I'm obviously not jogging right now. All right, move the camera. You got it. Oh, look at the pretty flowers. This is a this is a step up from from uh, Senu. I gotta say. Okay, we're in a cutscene now. <laughs> Considering like everything in that game was dark and horrible, this is like oh, it's beautiful. That. Goddamn, that is beautiful. Like actually. That is kind of what Colorado looks like in certain parts. I mean, maybe not that pristine. The water's probably not that pristine. But hey, animals. To leave the zen moment. Aw, cute. Alex. Hello. 
Hey, buddy. Oh, you are definitely like Holy older brother. Shit. That's really him. You're saying that as if you've never met met him before. Have you never met him before? <laughs> or is it just like, wow, you're all grown up or some shit? Oh. What's the protocol for reuniting with your long lost sister after eight years? Okay, you know what? Yeah. Oh, what? Hug. Well, he hugged me. Hug back. I'm cool with the hug if you are. <laughs> yeah. Aww. Oh, crushing my ribs still part of the protocol? <laughs> it's just so good to see you again. He's like, so? I can't believe you're here. Believe it. Ah, <sighs> uh, I'm sorry. What is that? Can I see people's auras? She's all grown up. I missed it. I can read people's minds. Okay then. She's just like this a is lot normal. Taller, huh? Yeah, yeah. Time will do that to you. Can I control? Are you ready to see the town? Or does it just like happen? Uh, you know what? Optimism. Let's go. Hell yeah! Let's rock and roll. Hell yeah! I don't know why I said that. Hey. Me neither. Ah, uh, see. <laughs> but I love the enthusiasm. Love the loves the enthusiasm. Hell yeah! Okay, the uh, black lantern is just up the street. I mentioned I live above a bar, right? Even better. I'm sure How's that doesn't trip? get noisy at all. You must be You have white. to tap down like, hey, be I'm quiet good. down there. The drive through the mountains was amazing. Eleanor, hey. Alex just got here. Alex, meet Eleanor Laith, owner of the flower shop, and honest to God, royalty of Haven Springs. Oh, it is so nice to finally wow, meet you. Wow, you are a lot smaller than Welcome. me. Welcome. Oh. We are so glad to have you, Alex. Gabe told us all about you. I'm glad to be here. Cool. So if I make a wrong choice in the game, is it gonna like punish me by like showing their thoughts and being like, wow, what yeah, an asshole? <laughs> a little quick on the draw with hugs though. Yeah, I can yeah, see no that. <laughs> Welcome to Haven. Wow. Damn, can I live here? Shit. I mean, they probably made it, like, a lot more greener than it actually is, but still, damn. Nice view of the mountains. You're, like, literally right there. I'm sure this get this place gets, uh, a shit ton of snow. Like, probably way too much snow. Brown Bear Diner. Oh. Th wow. It's nice. Come on. That's your reaction? I'd be like, damn, this place is freaking damn. Is this the first official stop on the tour? Absolutely. If you follow me inside, you'll find our prize exhibit. Gabe Chen buys makeup flowers for angry girlfriend. Wow. Oh, I can't wait. What'd you so, do? So <laughs> hey, Gabe. Riley, meet my sister, Alex. What's your greatest weakness? I'm uh, sorry, what? What? <laughs> Why'd you like look for me up and down and like that? Been this one for days. Gabe insists that I give an honest answer. It's always better to give an honest answer. And okay. what's the alternative? Lying? Not lying, more like strategic half-truthing. Like, I work too hard, or I save too many puppies. They could smell that bullshit a mile away. I've been trying to warn her. Oh, yeah? Okay. What would you do? You know what? I'd be honest. Play it safe. I would be honest. It's usually harder, but then you come off as more authentic. Called it. As much as I would love to wow. be clever, you colleges don't want to hear that. Pointing your way through town. I'm gonna be honest. Seems that way. <laughs> Alex, help me out real quick. Yeah, what's up? What do I get for Charlotte? Sunflowers are her favorite, but I read online that. Lily of the Valley is great for saying sorry. What do you think? <laughs> yeah, what did you do? What, uh, exactly are you apologizing for? What'd you this do? Maybe the toilet seat? <laughs> what do you mean, maybe the toilet seat? Well, what, not leaving the toilet seat down? Uh, well, it's not that serious. Go with sunflowers, go with their favorite. If Charlotte loves sunflowers, go with the sunflowers. That's what I was thinking. Wow, we were all, really are wonder twinning, like just like Riley said. 
She -ye -ye. You know, if Mac brought me flowers half as often, well, he wouldn't be Mac. <laughs> Is it still on and off with you two? Sort of. More on right now, but wait five minutes and ask again. <laughs> Oof. Put this on my tab? Yeah. Tab? <laughs> Are you sure you don't want to just tell Mac about the interview? No, not yet. I'll handle it. Okay, your call. We can leave when you're ready. Sounds good. Sure, what is going on with her and Matt? Might as well have a look around before we leave. She, alright. Ooh, gardening books. Oh, and use any of those to interact. Well, it's telling me why to interact, How so. to kill everything you touch. A flower book by Alex Chen. Hmm. Unlock like, unlocking the flavors of, of the earth. Gardener's Game by Mabel Richardson. Perfect flower bed by Susan K. Knight. A commands of Garden Real by Seth Quinn. Are these like full blown books? Oh, I just read the. Oh, I don't like actually open the. Okay, so read that just helps with the text. Okay, cool. Cute. <laughs> That'd be like full blown books that I can like. Mandatory. Read. For any enchanted garden. Oh, that's really pretty actually. I'd buy that, honestly. Although I'm not really a garden person because I have the black thumb. Aw, I wonder who they are. Maybe Riley's Cute, parents? Right? Yeah. Or are those grandparents? your grandparents? Yeah, they look way too no, old to be her parents. But they were like family. Alistair and Ava Murphy. Alistair. Nana bought the building from them before I was born. Alistair? What is this husband hotel? <laughs> I'm sorry, that is, no one's gonna get that reference. I mean, some people might. But you can make anything pretty an o, if you shove a bouquet inside. Oh, no category for estranged brother you haven't seen in eight years because you were ripped apart by the foster care system? Jesus! That's a shame. Alright, wait, way to friggin' just throw that on us. So that's how that happened. Sunglasses. This gnome has been places. I could throw sunglasses on him? I just had a pair of sunglasses on me, huh? Perfect. <laughs> I like that. All the yellow matches too. That guy's bad to the gnome. Right? I heard he won the Nobel Peace Prize. Oh god, <laughs> please stop. Oh, we're gonna torture you with our puns? No problem. <laughs> <laughs> Rolls eyes intensely. <laughs> that's cute. I like that. So how do I look at my inventory? Okay, that's the pause menu, obviously. Oh, here we go. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I only have pictures for... Oh, because I guess I haven't met any of these people yet. Oh, whoa. Hello. Lots of pet texts here. Let's read them. Hey, Alex. It's Chelsea. Thank you much, so much for your help with Harley last night. My jaw is still sore, but it could have been way worse if you didn't step in. Now, let's just see. I'm glad you're okay. Harley's awful. Don't worry. Not every girl is that bad. In foster care, text me if you need me, okay? Oh, damn. OMG, thank you. I didn't think I was going to get any birthday gifts. The necklace is beautiful. Happy birthday. Don't be too thankful. I bought it at a, at a pawn shop. LOL. Hey, orphans can be picky, right? Truth. Okay, wow. Yeah, they... Well, yeah, foster care is orphans, I guess. Hey, Alex, did I bother you? Do you have any spare pads on my fingers situation here? Wow, TMI. No bother. Check the drawer in my nightstand. I think I stashed them in there. You remain my hero. Thank you. Yeah, girls will be girls. So, see, I have something important to tell you, and I didn't, and didn't want to wait. At the end of the month, I'm going to move to Colorado and live with my brother. Leaving you was the little only downside to this plan. I'm really sorry. Just know that I'm always a phone call or text away, okay? Congrats. Don't be sorry. I'm so happy for you. Can we talk more this weekend? I want to hear all about it. Sounds good. Good luck today. I'll miss you. I'll miss you. Don't let anyone push you around too. Okay, you're right as hell. Life has been hard these past few years, but I'm really glad we met. Me too. Aw. Dr. Lynn. Oh, did, oh, weird, it just, oh, okay, so it went down to, like, oh, it's in alphabetical order, I see, okay, so Marielle is the last one, oh, wow, what is this, okay, hey, is the studio number, OMG Alex, hey, Mary, is it Mariella or Marielle, I don't know, so, I guess I'll learn, maybe, so good to hear from you, how are you, I'm okay, sorry to ask, but do you have a place I could crash, my amazing decision-making abilities got me into some trouble, what happened? Yes, of course. The apartment has a catch with your name on it. I'll call in with you. Thank you so much. I'll pay you back with tender love and affection. LOL. Merry Christmas, Alex. I hope you are someplace warm. Hey, Mari. Yeah, I'm totally smoking. Merry Christmas. Did you ever figure out things with Miss Stevens? No, she's a bitch. I ended up back in the group home after that. Kono? 
I don't know what that means. So sorry, allocutors are better, all good. I already added to them, I won't be sad if murder the place. When Maria bought the latest PTC but vinyl, I will trade it away for a few more nights on your couch. Hey, lol, sure thing, I'm home right now. Thanks, I promise I won't make this a habit. I got you, girl. Alex, how are you? Haven't heard from you in forever. Hey, sorry I missed this. This you've been crazy, but I'm managing you. One day at a time, I met a pretty nice guy at work. We've gone out a few times. Oh, cool, tell him to not f, f it up. Hey, I'm in the neck of your woods when I get a drink. Hola, chica. Already started. Let's go. LOL. I actually got a table at Auntie's for once. Come by. Sick. BRT. I don't know what that means. Hey, Mario, I'm really sorry, but can I crash again? I needed it. I just said I needed a break from the hellhole known as Helping Hands. Alex, I'm so sorry, but I have a few friends to stay with me right now, so I can't. Maybe in a week or two. No worries. I'll figure something out. Have a good night. You too. Good luck. Be safe. Hey, you okay? You left the bird pretty quickly last night. Hey, are you there? Mario, don't be quiet. I've told this to you to get. Please tell me, text me if you get this. I was just joking about the stuff I, st I said last week. There's nothing weird about me except, except that one birthmark. I was drunk. I was just joking. Mario, please, I need you of all people to not treat me like a freak, please. Ooh, things did not go well with Mariella. Yeah, I want to read all this text, but I'm reading them fast so I don't spend, like, forever reading them. Okay, let's see what Isaac's, whoever Isaac is, let's see what he said. Hey, Alex is Isaac from the record store. Thanks for schooling me on Brianna Lilac. Her first album was great. It was really nice meeting you yesterday. You must have the wrong number. I'm so sorry. I'm just kidding, dude. It's Alex. LOL. Jesus, I was so bummed out for a second. Why would you do that to me? Sorry, it was nice meeting you too. Would love to take you out for coffee sometime. You owe me one for that cruel and unusual joke. Huh, maybe next weekend. Great. I'll ping you Saturday. Have a happy Halloween. Hey, Alex, are you free to drink? Free... Are you free tonight for a drink? I know a, a spot downtown that serves literally the perfect sangria. Hey, Isaac, sorry for the delay. I can't do drinks with me coffee after long. You can try to redeem your musical tastes. Challenge accepted. Have you been to the Silver Kettle on SW Washington? Not yet. 3 p.m. See you there. I had a great time, Alex, despite your questionable choice in beverage. There's nothing wrong with hot chocolate. Hey, Alex, you free for drinks tonight? I'm craving another listen on Portland singers slash shine writers. Prepare for an education. Call me after lunch. You got it. Hey, beautiful. Whoa. Interested in a cocktail tonight or just tons of popcorn in a movie? Why not both? Now we're talking. Let's start with the cocktail. You free at eight ish. Sure. Very belated, but happy new year. Sorry I've been out of touch. Just busy with my program. Happy new year. Don't worry about it. Can I take you out tonight? How about full on dinner with wine and bread? Like actual dinner. Actual dinner sounds great. Thanks, Isaac. I'll get glammed up a bit. It's about time you need to step up your glam game. Hey, you haven't seen me at roll out of bed level glam. Maybe I'll see you that tomorrow morning. Easy there, trigger. The mean tiger? And oh, whatever. Hey Isaac, you around? Hey Alex, how goes it? Do you think I can crush your brothers tonight? That hashtag foster care life is catching up with me. Of course, I'll get out the wine. Thank you so much. I don't really need wine, but I'm actually pretty beat. I'll take it out just in case. Call me when you're downstairs. Alex, late ni last night was incredible. I'm really glad you came over. Everything okay? Hey, yeah, we just moved a little fast last night. Can we hold off on sex for a while? Whoa! What's wrong? I thought you were having a good time. I just wasn't in the right mindset. Sorry to hear that. You were giving me all the right signals, and I thought you were interested. Hey, Alex, want to get a drink? Alex, you wait. Let me know when you get these. Alex, come get drinks. I'm buying Alex. Hey, Isaac. Alex, Shen, no time, long time no see. I know, right? Listen, I need a place to crash tonight. Again, I can bribe you with free beer. You have something that's way better than beer, and you know it. I just need a place to sleep, and that's what I've got. And then some just come over. This call has been blocked. You will never. Yeesh. Wow. Okay. So they had a thing, and then he became way too woof. Okay. Hey, is this Gene? That's Cosmic Charlie, dear friend. To whom am I speaking? Alex, Stacy, give me your number. Are you still selling? Only to those who truly know how to, to surrender the to this flow. Yeah, never mind. Oof. Okay, so weed seller apparently. Um yeah, Chelsea I already read. Bridget. Okay. Don't effing think you belong to our family, bitch. Whoa, okay then. Is this Bridget? You're not gonna stay here, go back to where you came from. I wonder what your parents will think about this behavior. They won't believe you. You're texting me genius. I have a written record. F you. Damn, okay, I immediately don't like Bridget. Doctor Lynn, okay. Alex, we have a session scheduled in my office. Are you going to make it? Alex, punch all attendance of scheduled sessions with your assigned counselor. Alex, pre precondition of your residence and helping hands. Alex, let's call this strike one. I'm sorry, I lost trust of time per our session yesterday to pilot the self by Dr. Levy Hubner. Right, thanks. I hope you find it helpful. Just checking in. How are you feeling after everything? Is Heather okay? She's upset, which I think you'll agree is understandable, but she's not hurt. I'm so sorry. Alex, where are you? Your things are gone. Who are you with? Alex, please get in touch with me. No, no one knows where you are. Alex, I realize you're in an emotionally vulnerable position right now. I'd like to speak to you before I leave for the night. Are you settled in? Yes. May I, best stop May I stop by your room briefly? Yes. Good luck in this new chapter of life. Please know that I'm here for you. If you need me, this caller has been blocked. Damn! We blocked Dr. Lynn? What the hell? Damn, I want to know what happened with your past. Okay, wow. A lot of text from Gabe. 
Alex, who's this? Holy shit, Alex Chen. Sorry, who's this? Is Gabe? Is this some kind of joke? No, you dork. Call me right now. Hey, was the right catching up yesterday? Chat again later? Yes, yeah, sure. How was your weekend? Pretty good. Charlotte and I took Ethan hiking. Lots of fun. How about you? Finally, right, listen to the new Paint Thinner coffee album. They're killing it. PTC rips. Ever seen them live? Not yet. Devil will when I get the chance. Hey, how are things? Alex, I haven't texted things. Are a bit crazy. How are you? Things are weird right now. Dealing with it. Do you need help? No, I'm okay. Thanks. Alien, would you ever want to live in Haven? Duck, duck, not alien. You're not an alien. You're Ellie. Auto correct. Oh, oh, well, this phone is idiot. Ellie, are you awake? Oh, hey, bud. Have you been drinking? No, this is my natural state. Answer the question. Go to bed. Oh, F, I trump tested you. Here's the FTR. Offer stands. Haven's cool. Hey, what's up? Haven't heard from you in three days. Are you right? Alex, please help me when you get this. How are you holding up? I'm okay, it's been shitty here, but we've been through worse. Let me know if you're, you need anything. Well, so there was a period where, like, she was ghosting everyone. Will do, I can't believe you're coming. Yes, me neither. Thanks again for sending the ticket. You're a lifesaver. Of course, we're so excited to have you here. Tomorrow's a big day. You need anything? Nope, I'm good. Don't ha have much to carry, you know? Hey, I'm about an hour away. Can't wait. I'm ready for you. But she's pulled in. On my way. So excited. Aw. Woo! Okay, that was a lot of texts. Uh, let's look at the birdhouses. The tiny house movement is really taking off. And Lily of the Valley. Look at it. I hope Charlotte likes the sunflowers. Be fine, probably. Can I go back here? I can look at Riley. I can't talk to her. Hopefully my advice doesn't derail her entire life. I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. I can go back here. But I cannot open any of the doors. Hold LT when the... Ooh, to she managed to attach to the character. Ooh. Whoa, what? Oh, oh, whoa. What if I don't get in? Shit. What if I do get in? Am I really ready to leave this place? Whoa. If Riley's so anxious about leaving this town, I guess it can't be too bad. Can't do anything with Gabe. Uh, okay, I think I've looked at everything. So do I just, like, go to the door when I... I guess I'm just... Okay, leave when I'm ready. Cool. Well, considering I spent a shit ton of time... Looking at or reading all all of my texts. Once I'm done looking around, we can head out. Okay. Well, if you're gonna talk like that, then I was I'm, I was just gonna leave it at the pleasant little this here. But if you're gonna talk, then I guess I'll pause and we'll just sit in silence. Okay. But this is cool so far. Obviously, obviously haven't seen a lot, but we have powers. We have mind reading powers, apparently. Don't know how we got those, but we're probably born with them, like with everything else. Um, I want to know what happened in her past. I'm assuming we're going to learn that, right? Like, how could we not? Um, but anyway, this is fun so far. I love this. This is making me excited. Um, <clears throat> but anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here for now. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Bye.